Hello and welcome to the new Power BI tutorial video and in this video I want to show you uh, the Power BI hidden filters that is based on the previous video I showed sync slicer and how to view them sometimes it will be very confusing let's say to a new Power BI developer uh, for example if you are going to get a transition of a report or dashboard and you are really wondering why you are not getting the expected output or why the things are changing well it may be because there are some hidden filters and i want to show you very very quickly how to view them so that you will have more control or a complete control over the report or dashboard okay so before i show you just a quick information that this sheet is present in the description so that you can easily search any of my previously uploaded power bi video and very easily with the help of the links you can view it so that way you can have a good learning experience also you can bookmark the sheet so that it is handy to you whenever you need it for any specific topic all right let's move on to the power bi so over here we are using the sync slicer option if you remember from the previous video so what it is doing is we are making a selection in page two as you can see office supplies but it is also impacting the page three. This is what I showed in the previous video, which you can view it uh, by going here in the sync slicer and I will update the link maybe after I record this. I'm record done with the recording. So what's basically going on over here is like I said, a selection has been made here. So for example, if I select furniture, now furniture is selected over here and furniture is also present here, but you don't see any filter or anything i mean if even if you select the visualization everything is like profit is everything or sales is all subcategory is all and there is nothing on the filters on this page or on all pages so you may probably picking up your head or you know scratching your head as to what's really going on well in that case you know this within the view section the selection panel will be very helpful for you and that's a very quick tip i wanted to show you so if you click on that, you will see that you have this one slicer, which is hidden, right? So if you select this and you uncheck this, then you will see the slicer is basically present here. And this is based on the setting, what we did over here in the previous video. So that way, if I select the technology, you will see now that it is all accessories and everything. Same information will be coming here. But if nothing is displayed, then you need to come over here on selection panel and quickly see whether you have any hidden filter. And the way you will see this is, is this small slash sign is basically coming on the visibility. So that's, I wanted to show you how you can view the hidden filters within Power BI to get a con complete control. And especially in scenarios like those where you are not really sure what's going on or why the unnecessary filters or unrealistic filters are coming and uh, and basically confusing you so that's about it and i'll meet you in the next video with a new topic